Okay, so my name's Alistair McNeish and I teach cardiovascular pharmacology as part of the Masters of Pharmacy degree here at the University of Reading. The way that I got into my research is probably quite typical, but also there's a little bit of accident involved. So I, I did a de degree in pharmacology and that involved some research training as part of the degree and I was lucky enough to work in London for the Nobel Prize winner Sir James Black and that really sparked an interest. Uh, he developed uh, drugs called beta blockers back in the 1950s so he's a, he's a big name in the field. Really what drives my passion uh, for cardiovascular sciences, yes it was sparked by working for Sir James Black in a way but really at that stage in my career I was really just interested in how drugs affect the body. It was only really when I started doing cardiovascular research that I realised how many people these diseases uh, affect and I was really interested in how little we knew about how blood vessels worked. I was always assumed it was an area where perhaps we were more technologically advanced over say neuroscience and it turns out I was, I was completely wrong and that thirst for knowledge is a bit of a, a driver. In more recent years I think the passion um, really comes from being personally affected by these cardiovascular diseases as well. So for example recently one of my family members was diagnosed with high cholesterol and um, I had to have tests for high cholesterol as well and it turned out we had a, a family history and the reason I didn't know several of my uncles and I didn't know my grandfather was they had basically died from high cholesterol that was not treated properly and it was just something that was never mentioned to me as a, as a child. And also recently my dad had a heart attack and I think those personal um, th those personal things really drive the passion to find out more and perhaps prevent cardiovascular disease and find out more about cardiovascular diseases and see how we can treat them.